Ladies and gentlemen, I am about to start driving into central London because Disney has just invited your boy to see the first three episodes of Andor on the big screen in Cineworld. Central London, that's actually my cinema as well, Cineworld, big up you guys, uh, but most importantly, Big up Disney. Thank you so much for reaching out to your boy for this invite. Very, very sick. I'm uh, really, really grateful, truly. And yeah, let's go check it out, man. First three episodes, gonna be giving you a spoiler-free review. Uh, I do wanna quickly say that next week for and or episode four will be the normal show, ladies and gentlemen. I will be reacting to the full episode on YouTube. Make sure you sub, make sure you hit the dumb bell. But now, let's go and check out and or. All right, apparently, uh, yeah, B2 is here. I don't know how this thing's moving, uh, but it's actually amazing, mate. Absolutely amazing. So we're about to see Andor, episodes one to three. And uh, yeah, big up Disney, big up City World for this invite. Because uh, yeah, this is really sick, man. And uh, we've got the droid out here <laughs> doing circles, mate. Very, very sick. And uh, yeah, this is, this is too cool, man. This is too cool. This could be, I'm just saying, uh, my next favorite droid next to BB-8. But hey, don't tell R2-D2, bruv, yeah? Because, uh, yeah, I don't even know how this thing's moving, but it's very, very, very sick. What are you applauding? <laughs> That's appropriate. <laughs> Has something very special to say to us. Hello, London. I am B2 EMO. I am so very pleased to meet you all this evening. <laughs> A few moments later. And we're done, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, again, big, huge love. Huge, huge love to Disney for inviting your boy, man. So I've just come out of London, Leicester Square, bruv. Uh, City World, big up City World. I've seen Andor episodes one to three in IMAX. This is gonna be my non-spoiler review. Do not worry, there'll be no spoilers in it at all. Uh, I'm gonna review it like as a whole. First of all, it's hella mature. Like there is, I would say of the three episodes, if we're going from 100%, for me personally, I found there's about five to 10% comedy. There's pretty much hardly any. I would say it's even more serious than Mando. It's probably the most serious Star Wars show so far. Uh, there's no little Grogu. There was the droid, which I did get to meet in person. Very, very sick. B2, I think his name was. I'm not gonna be reviewing uh, like each individual episode. I'm just gonna review it as a whole. Uh, it's very mature. Uh, it's set five years before Rogue One. Uh, there's a lot of new characters. Obviously, Andor is just killing the role, man. Killing the show. Very, very awesome. I feel kind of bad because I said initially, I don't really care about this show. I want to see other stuff. And then the official trailer dropped and I was very, very hyped. And this show was very, very sick. Very mature. Uh, it's a good thing Disney decided to drop three episodes. There is so much build up. And I genuinely think like at the end of episode three, that is the start of the show. I think there's nine more episodes left. It's crazy. I'm so glad. Uh, that it's long it's not some six episode quick thing uh, it needs to be long there's a lot of setup a lot of new characters it's very very sick man if you're a die hard star wars fan like me you're gonna be extremely happy if you're very 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 casual you liked rogue one but you don't really like care about the star wars universe as a whole still definitely definitely check this out this feels immediately like as soon as the theater went dark and the screen like started with the andor logo it feels like Rogue One, bruv. It's very, very sick. If you're a fan of Rogue One or, again, Star Wars, you're gonna be very, very, very happy. And that's all I could really say. I mean, again, this is like the proper start. You need to watch, in my opinion, uh, all three episodes back to back. Don't watch one and then leave it like a week or a few days. Try and watch all three. Uh, it went hella quick, I gotta be honest. I think every episode is like between 30 minutes and 40 minutes. It went very, very quick. But overall, uh, score-wise, I would say, by the way, episode three is definitely the best one. Uh, but overall, for your boy, ladies and gentlemen, if I'm grading three like as a package, should we say, uh, for now, eight out of 10. Very, very sick. Uh, and I can't wait to see, bro, uh, the next few episodes. Coming from next week, starting from next week, I will be reacting uh, from episode four onwards, full reactions as normal. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Again, big love to Disney. Really appreciate the reach out, man. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Peace.